To create the high-level project plan, click the Dashboard button, which brings us to the project dashboard. This shows us the project title, Exia Demo. We can type a new project description in here. We can set the project start date. Let's set that to January 1st of 2012. And we'll set the end date to June 30th. So this is a six month project. The iterations start and end date shows when the iterations actually begin. Typically projects have some planning time before the iterations start. So let's set the start of the actual iterations to January 15th. We'll make it the Monday following. This next line shows us the iteration planning tasks. These are tasks that happen at the beginning of each iteration. If we just look at the an iteration, we see those tasks appear here. And then the finalization tasks appear at the end of each iteration. We can alter that list if we want. So instead of kickoff meeting, we might have a um, startup meeting. And you can see that that is updated in the iteration. And that list holds for each iteration. So we'll just reset it back to the default and leave it like that. Our development team size on this project will set to a default of two. And we'll apply that to all the iterations. If we click an iteration here, we can see the development team size is two, which can be customized on a per iteration basis. Next, we want to enter the vision for the project. Next, we'll enter the problem and the mission and the objectives and the key milestones and the risks and finally the environment. And finally, we click Save to save the high-level project plan.